Hi YouTube, today I do have a desktop computer which has a Windows 7 and as we already know, the Windows 7 has expired and I am going to upgrade this machine to Windows 10 To do that, we need a USB memory stick The memory size has to be at least 8GB Plug the USB to your computer Now, go to Google and type Windows 10 download and what we are looking for is the Microsoft official website. In my case, the top result is the one that I want. It says download Windows 10 disk image ISO. Click download tool now. And you can save the download file or you can run it right away after download is finished. We are gonna need it so I'm gonna run it right away after the download is finished. It's now getting a few things ready So we have to wait Now we do see the agreement Just accept the agreement and click next More ratings If you are looking for Windows 10 upgrade from Windows 7 or 8 Choose the first option then it will upgrade and it'll keep all of your files and programs. In my case, I'm going to remove everything from my existing drive and do a fresh installation of Windows 10, so I'm going to choose the second option. In here, you can customize your Windows 10 disk, you can change the language, you can change the 32-bit or 64-bit windows. After the customization is done, click Next. As I told you earlier, I need a USB booting disk, so I'm choosing USB drive. I have several USB devices attached to my laptop, so I have to choose the right device. After that, the tool will try to download and install Windows 10 on my USB drive. It's basically making my USB drive a bootable Windows 10 disk. Next step is to purchase Windows 10 license. I'm on a website called Brightsoft. The address is ca.brightsoft.com. The reason I'm here today is because they do sell Windows 10 and Windows Microsoft Office program at really low cost. It's a digital copy and therefore you can get it at really low cost like $30, $50. I am looking at Windows 10 Pro and as you see, for one copy of Windows 10 license, it's only $29.99. You can use your credit card or PayPal to purchase this. And as soon as you purchase, you get an email with the license key and you can use the license key to activate the software. It is now time to install Windows 10 on this old desktop computer with Windows 7. Connect the USB memory turn on the machine and before it loads Windows 7 you have to get into your BIOS and boot from the USB drive that you just made to do it I'm hitting the delete key multiple times and I'm in the BIOS I am trying to boot from my USB drive Now, if you wait about 5 to 10 minutes, the Windows 10 installation will begin. Enter the license key that you just got from the Brightsoft. Accept the agreement Once again, this gives us two different options Upgrade or Custom Since I'm not trying to upgrade this machine, I'm gonna choose Custom But if you do want to upgrade your Windows 7 to Windows 10, you can choose the first option 
next is to manage your partitions. I'm trying to do a fresh installation of Windows 10. So I'm gonna delete all the existing partitions. Then I'm going to install Windows 10. That was your final step to install Windows 10. Now the installation begins. It takes some time, so wait for some time and then come back to configure your Windows 10. That was how to do a fresh installation of Windows 10. If you have any questions, feel free to leave comments and subscribe to our channel for more future videos. Thank you for watching.